Hampshire woman and five others will swim across the English Channel in the summer to raise money for Swim Taker. This is a charity which sends qualified swimming teachers around the world to train other people to help children and adults swim safely. Debbie Adams from Retford began swimming in open water to improve her mental health in 2017 after her son was stillborn. Now, with some friends she met through open water swimming, Debbie has begun training to swim 21 miles from Dover to France. And I'm very happy to say that I'm joined by Debbie alongside fellow swimmers Tammy Goddard and Karen Purdy. Um, thanks for taking time out for training, for coming on. Um, uh, Debbie, first of all, could we just, just talk about your son and, and how you got into swimming as well? Yeah, so I've always, always liked the the, um, the water and swimming and then um, I've always looked forward to or wanted to do something a bit crazy I suppose like this sort of challenge um, but I fell pregnant with Riley and then um, we unfortunately um, lost him he was still born at term and um, after that I got back into open water swimming and I just find that being in the open water it just really helps you kind of focus your mind on the things you want to think about or sometimes forget about the things that are going on in the, the rest yeah. of the world. Um, so yeah, I got into that, uh, did a few smaller challenges, nothing like this. Um, and then I fell pregnant again with my daughter um, and she is now, well, I keep saying three and a half, she will be four in July. <laughs> my, my daughter just turned four and I still say that. She's yeah, yeah. three and a bit. Three. Yeah. She's gonna be three and a half yeah, until the right. second of July and then yeah, it'll be, yeah. she'll be four. Um, and so obviously I couldn't take up a big challenge while she was young, but then um, last year, um, I got the opportunity to join a team with a friend of mine, um, Claire, or she opened the opportunity for us to join the team um, and, uh, yeah, decided to take on the challenge. And then Karen here started working for me as a swimming teacher and I said, do you want to swim the channel? And so that was... Did you have any choice? Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Is it something you'd have thought about doing? I've always said I never wanted to swim the channel. Right. However, when Debbie said um, about doing the, the relay, it's a different, yeah. um, it's still a massive swim, a bit iconic. But yeah, I just thought, yeah, I'll step in and um, support Debbie alongside, really. And Swim Taker, it's a brilliant charity. Yeah. You know, and something that we're both passionate about, you know, yeah. doing getting kids swimming and water safety and all of that so yeah i just said yeah yeah, <laughs> yeah uh, well why not and, and tammy how did where, how did you get roped in, <laughs> me in. <laughs> oh i see so basically if anyone meets any of you beware yeah. because yeah. you're likely yeah, exactly. to yeah. Right, okay. well it was really strange because we'd had a conversation and i said that swimming the channel was on my bucket list and right. i wanted to do it before i was 55 and then in march karen said Oh, you know, you said the swimming the channels on your bucket list. Would you like to do it? So five years earlier, but yeah, it has always been on my bucket list. So, and I guess like the fact there's because there's six of you all together. Yes. Yeah. So I mean that in itself must must be brilliant. You know, it's your own little group who are, who are all doing this, and yeah. you know, what's the training like? Uh, so we're we're all training differently and together. Like tonight, we're going to go and do some cold water swimming after we've been here so we'll go and do it'll, it'll be a shorter swim this evening where'd you do that um so tonight we're going to a dike up in sheffield okay um so yeah we'll go there we'll probably do not a dike dike no. a, a lakey yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah yeah i was gonna say yeah yeah it's, i mean just extreme swimming in itself isn't yeah it? um okay yeah so we'll do that and then we do we still do pool training, don't we? Yeah. So we try and get in the pool maybe two or three times a week. And then at the moment, because the water temperatures are still quite chilly, um, we're just increasing our exposure and how long we can stay in the water for. Wow. So, that's yeah. amazing. Yeah. Um, can we just talk about the charity then? You say you're, you're so passionate about it, Karen, all of you. Um, mm. Just tell us a bit about what they do. Um, so Swim Taker are a charity worldwide doing uh, swimming lessons for children in different countries that don't have access to swimming uh, or swimming instruction. So they will fund and take out teachers across the world, Bahamas, Bali, mm -hmm. Indonesia, not fancy South that. America. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, never say never. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that could be a different venture. Um, and so basically they're 
linking in with local communities and other charities in those countries, trying to promote the swimming and just giving whole communities the whole package, not just swimming lessons, but also about the environmental status, right. so keeping your waters cleaner, doing... It okay. covers a whole range of things, so from water safety, water lessons, to cleaner water, environmental... And the education there as well, yeah. sometimes they'll train up locals to be able to then deliver the lessons oh, when mm -hmm. like the in instructors have come back to the UK. So. Um, where can we follow you and, and how can we get involved in sponsor, do you do sponsorship I yeah, guess? Yeah, yeah. we've yeah. got, yes, um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we've got um, swim taker sponsor pages so mine would be uh, Debbie Adams uh, Channel Swim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, oh I've forgotten what it that's fine. Yeah. We'll, we'll Google that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Channel the swimming. Yeah. yeah. So swim taker. Yeah. And we've all in got July. Right. Yes. In July. July. It'll be warm. Yeah. It'll be lovely. Yeah. Thank you so much Thank for coming you. on. Thank you. That's Thank brilliant. You. Thank you. Uh, now, in a bit, I'm going to be chatting to the team going for gold at this year's Chelsea Flower.